Welcome to Edupedia World Videos, Virtual World Free Education. My name is Zuraya Sayed, Microsoft Certified Trainer. Excel helps you to double check your Excel sheets before you send them across to someone else. Excel comes with the ability to check the spelling of your file. It can be done using the spelling checker, often called spell check. It looks for misspellings in the current worksheet. If you have a multiple sheet workbook, you can select the sheets you want to check before you start the spell checker. And if you want to check all worksheets in the workbook all at once, just right click on the worksheet tab and choose select all sheets. Also, if you select a range of cells, only those cells will be checked. Now let's ask ourselves where to find the spell checker. There are two ways you can find it. The first way is using the ribbon. Click the spelling button in the proofing group of the review tab. The second way by using the keyboard shortcut F7. Excel began the checking the spelling of text entries in your worksheet. When the program comes across an unknown word, it displays the spelling dialog box, which have many suggestions. Excel suggests replacement for the unknown word. If you want to fix the error by using one of the suggested words, select the word in the suggestions list and then click change. But clicking change all, that will change all occurrence of this misspelled word in the worksheet to the selected word in the suggestion list. If you want to ignore the misspelled word, because you know it is possible to be used and you want to move on to the next misspelled word, click ignore once. And if you want to ignore all instances of this misspelled word and move on to the next misspelled word, and if you don't want the spell checker to query you about this word again, click ignore all. If the misspelled word is a real word that you use, such as your name or my name is Soraya, I want all of Office program to recognize this word and not to treat it as a misspelling. And I want to add this unknown word to a custom dictionary. So. Click Add to Dictionary. The last option. If you make this mistake a lot, so you want the program to automatically correct this mistake for you. Whenever you type it, click Autocorrect. Excel will add it to the autocorrect dialog box. Here is my spellchecking.xlsx 
In this example, I intended to do some spelling mistakes and also to highlight these mistakes using different font colors. For example, the word customers has extra S letter and it is repeated twice in my sheet. Also, the word engineer You can notice that letter E is missing and also it is repeated twice in the sheet. Also notes E is missing and it is repeated twice. That mistakes what you and me can notice with our eyes. Let's see what Excel will do with these mistakes. Before starting the spell checker, let's click cell A1. Then from the review tab, click the spelling button on the proving group. The spelling dialog box appears and Excel discovers the first mistake. The word customers. And it gives me many suggestions. It recommends me to replace customers with double S with the first correction customer with only one S. The second suggestion customers apostrophe S and customers apostrophe or plural. Now I decide to replace with the first suggestion which is customers only one S letter. So I click change. If you look at the sheet you will find that the word customer is replaced correctly in the first location but if you look at E16 you will find that Excel leave it as it is and the Excel will ask me again about this second occurrence of the word customers when it comes to checking You can notice that Excel automatically jumps to the next mistake, which is speciality, and it recommends me two suggestions. The first one is suitable for me, so I will click change. The third one, address, and it corrects it for me with only one suggestion then I click change for the word notes I will choose the third one and I want to tell Excel to change it automatically if Excel find it while checking the rest of the sheet Excel immediately corrects the word notes in cell F3 but it won't change it in cell A15 because notes in cell F3 start with capital N but notes in cell A15 start with small n and Excel will treat them as different words. Again, for the word engineer, I will told him to change all the word engineer that is not in the dictionary with the first choice engineer. Now we are going to check a person name like Yusuf, and it can be written different ways as you like it. It can be written with E 
or using I. It is up to you either to change it or ignore it. For permanent solving this situation, you can add it to the dictionary. To make Excel stop asking you about it again. Also, Fahmi is a name for a person. Farouk. Fahmi. Habib. The word instructor has double O and I want to correct it for all its entries. I want to ignore this error or you can ignore all entries of the word Zachariah. Now, the word pharmacist, I usually make this mistake when I type pharmacist. And I want Excel to automatically autocorrect the word pharmacist for me every time I do this mistake. So on until I finish all the spell checker. After finishing all the words mistakes, Excel will show me that spell check is complete for the entire sheet. Click OK to confirm that these modifications or corrections. You have two ways to check a single worksheet. It depends on your cursor position. If your cursor is on Cell A1, it will check the entire sheet completely. But if you click in any other cell, it will start spell checking from there. Here is again my example before checking. This time I will click in the middle of the sheet, for example in cell A16. Then I will start the checker. The spelling dialog box appears and it starts checking from cell A16. After reaching the end of the worksheet, it will ask you, do you want to continue checking at the beginning of sheet? If you click yes, it will check all the left cells. But if you select no, then it will leave the other cells as it is. Finally, Microsoft Excel doesn't have advantage capabilities like grammar checking and correction, but still it offers the basic spell checking functionality. Unlike Microsoft Word, Excel doesn't underline the misspelled words as you write them. It will only tell you about the misspelled word when you hit the spell check button. Thank you for watching Edivedia World Videos. See you at the next video.